What is up YouTube? This is Collector's Dream. Hope you guys enjoying your day, your night, your morning, whenever you're watching the video. Uh, look at all these mad-ass finds that I have. So, let's start off the Gran Turismo. I managed to get the full set. Full set of eight. Trying not to get it. So, we have the Nissan Skyline right here. Very beautiful R32. Um, really, really nice packaging. So, we'll put it at the top because we've seen it. Number two is the Jaguar. Look at this Jaguar, Look, it looks really detailed. I like the fact this is the first time I've actually managed to get the whole set uh, without waiting for long, without trying to find it in bits and pieces. I think it's just a bit of my dog's hair. Uh, this, is a, this is a very nice Ford GT, very detailed as well. So I'm putting aside, obviously all of these are going to be opened up and had a look at. Some of these already seen double, so this is my third Pagani. I'm not going to pronounce the last name of it because I just don't know how to do it. Next up, we have the Dodge Dodge Viper right now. This is number five. I really like this. Like, the, I don't collect card cards, but if I did, obviously, this is one of the card cards that I would want to because the fact is I have all eight. Um, really, really proud of it. Aston Martin. Very good looking one. 77 logo on it. It kind of looks like from the Spectra. Obviously, it's not. And we're coming up to the last two. This is a double again. The Lamborghini uh, 57, really cool looking one, put it on the side. And then we have the last one, which is also a Lamborghini. Um, yeah, very cool looking set. Guys, uh, I'm really, oh, stuff is falling down right now. Let's see what fell down. Oh, I know what fell down. It's movie stuff that's fell down. Before we get to that, one more Skyline, the R34. From Need for Speed, so this is a movie. I don't know. I haven't seen the film. I don't know if it's exactly the movie or from the game. I think it might be from the game because it's got the EA logo, so it, and it doesn't have the movie sticker. So I'm probably guessing this is from the game. Really cool. I love the decal, and it looks really. I reckon it look much cooler once we take it out. But we're gonna do it later. Um, next up, managed to pick up one of these things, Yellow Submarine. I see everybody has them, and I, this is the first. I saw one, and I click quickly grabbed it. And yeah, as you guys can see, I had a bit of a really good haul, so can't complain about that. Next up, we have, all right, I'll do quickly the ones that fell. It is um, Batman vs. Superman. Uh, oh, no, this is Batman the Dark Knight, 3 or 5, but this is a color variation. As you guys can see, they're both number 3 or 5 Batman vehicles, but one is um, dark blue. One is black with red rims. Otherwise, there are pretty. It's just a color variation, so that's pretty cool. The fact that we have a color variation right here. Uh, we have a peanuts thing, the peanuts movie. I don't know if it's a car or what. Obviously, it's just thing for the movie merchandise, but I still like it. And um, yeah, I'm not going into much detail to that one. Let's go into the BMW. Now, look at this. We have one, two, three, four, five. No, that's not the right one. Seven and eight. I'm missing one car. I, I, I was so close. I was like, oh my god, I'm gonna get two sets in one go, but I didn't. I only I managed to get the seven out of eight. So, but we're starting off with a BMW M1. This is a very nice looking car. Obviously, it's still carded, as you guys can see. And you guys know that I love my Mercs. Um, my best mate loves his BMWs, and he bought himself the whole set of eight. He couldn't wait to find them, which is shame i think like it's one of the, the this is one set that i definitely don't want to open up i do already have some doubles so i will open up the doubles but knowing that it's bmws and yeah i'm just might just give it away or might just keep it for myself carded on cards and you guys know that i don't usually keep cards so the fact that i'm keeping cards just means that how much special these cars are bmw 2002 it's a pretty cool one. They already, they have released a couple of 2002. There is um, color variations. Here is one example. That's really nice. Um, I haven't seen any singles yet, so I'm pretty sure. Did I get it? No. So I bought a couple of these ones, 10 packs, but obviously they're gonna come later. Um, and in the 10 pack, there was that BMW. Um, then we have the M3. Sports edition, really nice looking car, and I love the car details. I love how like they're displayed on the card. I think it just looks really cool. Um, this is an a BMW M4. I'm surprised. Like I don't know if it's a color variation or what, because obviously you guys can see it's got the stripe. I haven't seen any with the stripe, so maybe thinking the stripe ones are more rare color variation. If that's true, give me a comment in the section below. 
Uh, next up, we have the BMW Z4 or Z4, depends how you pronounce it. Really nice car. I, like I said, like the artwork on the BMW for me is way cooler than on the GT. Um, so that's the reason. That's pr pretty much one of the reasons that I also don't want to take it apart unless I have doubles. And I though I don't collect. You guys know that I don't collect bikes. The fact that I just want to have a whole set of BMW. And hopefully, I'm I'm hoping that next year they do or this year they do one for Mercedes Benz. That'd be one that I would be hunting like crazy. Um, last but not least, out of these ones, we have the Honda Odyssey. Really cool. I know there's a taxi floating around. I've seen it on Instagram. I'm hoping to find a couple of those taxis, but for the time being, I have to do with the Honda. Now let's go to my entertainment series, which I will be opening up as well. So check it out. We have the Aston Martin from uh, Skyfall. Batmobile from Dawn of Justice, Batmobile from the TV series, Adam West one, we have the Homer, and last but not least, we have Acto 1 from Ghostbusters. Obviously, all of these are going to get opened up, guys, and get to see them, and maybe even compare the Batmobiles to the normal release, both of these ones, to compare to the entertainment ones, see what the difference is. Obviously, I already know they're going to weigh more. Um, they're going to be much more detailed, rubber tires, better paint job, better interior. But nevertheless, still going to be really cool. Same with the Homer one. I have the Homer one from the uh, main release. But um, I always actually really was looking out for that one. Uh, this is the second version of it. I know they released it in 2015. And um, so they released 2015, 2015. I'm pretty sure there's an entertainment version of this one as well. So obviously these are re-releases. Um, I'm not sure what the difference are. I don't have this one from 2015. I might have this one. And I don't have this one. But yeah, that's it, guys. That's it for the video. Just so this is what's coming. Expect it. I'm really excited. This is a really awesome haul that I managed to get. I mean, I've got lots more lots more other stuff to go through. But I felt for this video, just that would be enough. Kind of just to show you guys some of the cool things that I did manage to pick up. Also, from a 10-pack. Oh, some stuff has fallen down. It's the skyline. From a 10-pack, managed to pick up this one. And I couldn't wait to open it up. Uh, in front of you guys, so I literally opened that 10 pack up, but um, yeah, I do have other 10 packs. I did buy three 10 packs, one's open, two are still closed. So I might do like one opening of the one of the 10 packs and just show all the cars there. But this is a really, I love, I'm loving the Datsun. How could you not like a Datsun right here? I don't know how many variations they do, but I think I, I'm hoping they keep on doing more just so that we have more, um, more of these cool castings available. Yeah, um, so that's it guys, um, stick with me and I will be back soon.